Hey everybody, we are going from the living room for today, because uh, I've been playing Cult of the Lamb on Switch, but uh, the Switch, frankly, <laughs> runs pretty, pretty garbage for the Cult of the Lamb, so we're going to be doing it. If I had the PS5 out here, I think I had a PS4 cult, but I haven't, um, yeah, I'm not sure if that transfers over to the PS5, so we're either going to check in with that cult, see what's happening, or we're going to start a new one. Either way, you know, it, I'm going to be coming in kind of fresh, because it's been a long time since I played that one. I've been playing a lot on the Switch lately. I mean, a lot for me. Outside of streaming, I don't usually have a ton of time for gaming, um, and I've been stalling so that I can get the Twitch app updated. Um, cool, so that we can, I can check that, uh, my sound is good. Cool, so that we can, I can check that, uh, my sound is good. Great. Yeah, sounds good. And so I can have chat up on my iPad rather than up on the screen to bug all of you. So... Let's get it. Whoa, TV is very loud. What was I watching? Oh, right. I was watching this new Scott Pilgrim show, Scott Pilgrim Takes Off, and it was uh, weirdly quiet. It's a good show, though. I'm not going to say too much because there's a lot you can spoil with this one, but I was already a huge fan. Oh, yeah. Let's turn on dyslexic fonts. Um, I was a huge fan of the... Uh, of the comic and the movie. Um, so, yeah, we're gonna, I, I, I really liked that. Uh, sorry, I just realized how oily my face is. I'm gonna go dab some of that sweat off so I don't have a breakout. Okay, cool, I do have that still. Okay, I'm gonna be right back.
Okay, yeah, sorry about that. I've been trying to be really careful because I have a pretty oily complexion and uh, I'm finally getting my acne under control. But I gotta like dab in my face with these oil blotting sheets like a couple times a day. And I've been so busy today I forgot to do it uh, around dinner time, which is usually when, when I do it for the second time. Um, but they're great if you got an oily complexion or problems with acne. You know, the clean and clear makes them, um... Clean and clear makes the sheets, but there's also, I just get the generic ones. Uh, this is Strig's Wiggles, which is what I named my... I, I, get out of here. Uh, which is what I named my cult in this one, which was my first cult. Uh, the one that I have on Switch that I've gone a lot further in, I think I'm around day 40 for that, I call, uh, Prancy Dancers. But yeah, I don't remember where I was at with this, so it's gonna take a bit to, like, remember. I have all of my flar farm plots in my new one, uh, way more tightly clustered, so I don't know what's happening with this. Oh, uh, hey, Mal, what's up? Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I'm streaming at a slightly different time because I've been so busy the last weekend of the game jam so uh, I'm pretty happy with it you know I made like I've gotten like five play tests in and I finally figured out what I think is gonna be the way to make the idea work and I'm pretty pretty excited to get another play test in although I won't be able to until at least Monday I was hoping to get one tomorrow but I finally got a chance to get a playthrough of arcs with somebody, so I don't want to pass that up because I've been trying to do that for like months. Um, yeah, let's see. Ah, uh, full of berries. Hello. Oh, I guess I already talked to you today. Talk to you today. Uh, oh, okay. I guess I. What time? Oh, yeah, it's almost the end of the day. Wow. Yeah, this is very different from my town and the other one. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to know about the game, just let me know and I will describe it for y'all. It's a pretty fun limited communication, um, limited communication hide and seek game. It's cooperative, so you're, you're trying to get found. You're not trying to hide away, but you're not allowed to really talk to each other very much. So it can be tricky. Um... What am I missing? Gold? Coins? I need coins. Probably more farm stuff. Okay, I can't do much of that since they're all asleep. I wanna upgrade these. I don't know why I spread- Whoa. Oh, jeez! Oh, that's not right. Sums up. I- That's incorrect. That's a glitch. Okay, um, let's run and check on the, uh, yeah, on the other regions here, and then maybe I'll go on a crusade after I do all of my morning stuff, I think. Um, oh, ooh, controls are slightly different. What was that? Ooh, a rat. Rat. Okay. Um, this is full up, I think. Oh, well, almost. Uh, do some fishing overnight. Uh, can I change my controls a little bit? Want the dodge roll to be X. Cancel. Attack. Yeah, I want B. There we go, that feels better. Um, don't want to do that. Hello? Ah, who dares enter our sacred house of light? 
apologies. It's just that the lighthouse is getting dimmer no matter how hard we worship, and the ships keep sinking on the rocks. No ships means no new pilgrims to walk the sacred path. If only our leader was here, she would know what to do. We've not seen her since she went for a walk on the pier late one night. We begged her not to go, but we all know of the teeth in the darkness, but she would not listen. Now we have no choice but to pray until the lighthouse is lit once more. All hail the mighty light. Oh, yeah. It's a mood. Er, whoops. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. The weather change between seasons always kind of messes me up for a little bit. Uh, gasp! Our prayers have been answered. Thank you, O Bright One, for sending that lamb to save us. Now the pilgrims will return to our shores. For a story of the light, we pledge ourselves to you. We are your unworthy servants, mighty lamb. We will pray to you and your great light on the shrine. Please be in our adoration. I don't mind if I do. Hmm. Actually, maybe I want... Maybe I want layout. Let's see, what is that? Not quite. Oh, can I just do custom? Okay, advanced dialogue would be X. Attack would be, yep. Sure. Um, dodge roll, I want to be square. Attack, I want to be that. Uh, I'll take that for the curse. Whoops. Hmm. Actually, let's do circle for the curse. A uh, triangle for heavy attack. Uh, interact will be X. Interact 2 will be square. Interact 4 will be circle. Yeah, so we got a uh, string on X and spinning around. Okay, return to cult. Bleat. Oh, I didn't know there was a bleat button. Oh, that's fun. Nice. Okay, that feels right. Okay, he wants some lobster, so let's do some fishing. Fishing minigame in this is okay. It's basically a Stardew Valley one. What? Stardew Valley one, but a little looser. I think it actually controls a little bit better in this than it does on the Switch version. The Switch version of this game is okay, but it just does not perform great. You'd be surprised, even though it's like a 2D game, it's like, there's a lot going on in the background of this. Come on. Come on, have a munch. Take it back. Alright. Let's chunk 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 chunk. Get it. Yeah, thank you. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Okay, I'll take it. Nom 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 nom. Okay. Come on. Come on, what do you want you guys to be a lobster? Nope. Oh, come on, man. What about you? Okay, I gotta give up on those. I ain't gonna go much anywhere. 
believe there's a secret back here. Might have already got that on this file. Um, I don't have much cash. I think I got more mushrooms, so we should go and turn those in. Whoop. Oh, I haven't bought much. Well, I don't have much cash, man. Broke as heck. Yes, yes, this will do just fine. Okay, so they'll show you this with you this ritual, but you must not show anyone. Stay back or you will get brainwashed too. Sweet. Helpful. Especially when I'm about to grow up, go on a crusade. It's good to lock them off. Uh, but afterward, many of them will fall sick, but oh well. Now that you've seen, you can go to your temple and perform the ritual yourself. You say so, man. No, Murdy! No! Crap, so I gotta build a body pit real quick. I gotta talk to everybody. Where was I keeping the body pits in this one? Oh, did I not even have one? Let's get him out of here. I'm in the corner for right now. What was I doing with my... Did I... Hmm. I don't know what I was doing with them. Don't even have a body pit. I should cook everybody breakfast. They're looking a little hungry. Ooh. The deadly dish. Um, let's just get everybody set up with some basic berries. I am oink, doink. Do you want some berries? Gruel. And yeah, I had to have been doing something with my dead guys. Nice dance with all of them. Always great when you can make that happen. A little extortion. I had a capybara and a fennec fox here. Cool. I like capybaras a lot. Although they look a little strange in this style. I don't know if I'm, uh... Let's go with that. Wow, yeah, this runs so much better than the Switch version. Switch version is always struggling at least a little bit. There we go. Hey there, Sparkles. Yeah, I believe I tried for a little bit to, uh... To name all of them original stuff, but I just ran out of ideas so fast that I was like, Okay, never mind. Boy, howdy, is that really all I had? Okay, yeah, this is not a great start, but I'm only a few... I think I'm doing better than I was this far into my other spot, but I definitely need a lot more resources to work with. Yeah, that 
should level us up. Bam, there it is. Um, what does Kudai's blessing do again? Eh, don't really care. Um, oh, what is this? Oh, that's okay. Oh, yeah, obviously we'll do this. Just an improvement all around. Alright, I got another tablet. Um one order can be pretty useful. Oh, you know I want the wedding. Come on, you can't pass up the wedding. that they stay cool. Saw somebody had leveled up there. So that'll give me the time to go on a crusade. Okay. Oh, come on, I didn't wake everyone. They were already awake. Don't give me that guff. Nope. Okay, there we go. Got him just before he went to bed. So we are gonna run off and do a crusade. Um, do we have berries? Could be good. But, uh, let's, let's just go do a crusade. I need the, the stuff for it, you know? The stuff from it, I should say. I'm already realizing my controls are backwards. Whoops. Hold up. It isn't until you're on the Crusades that you really notice, like, uh, how you want to do stuff. There we go. Get him, get him, get him. Ooh. Some fallen rocks. We're okay. There we go. Don't want to miss out on any bones. Bones at this point in the game are pretty useful. So you gotta grab every one that you can. Sure, later you'll just have so many bones it's just out of control. Hmm. Let's go down. Nope. I usually, if you hit a uh, place for fighting, 
it usually means you didn't get all the side stuff, so... Hop back for a second to see if there was, like, a tarot room or something. Oh, I forgot to check if I had a different... Uh, fleece. Because I have one in the version on the Switch where it like gives you it gives you four tarot cards right at the beginning but then none during which yeah you don't get to hang out with the tarot guy which sucks i like that guy but just having four tarot cards right from the start is pretty op ah oh, jeez i have to remember to use my curses I haven't picked up any relics yet, although I don't even know if I've unlocked the relic guy in this playthrough. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Dang dog, you still drinking? I don't know if you guys can hear that, but the uh, dog's water bowl is just like right to the right of uh, where I'm playing. And she decides not to drink water until, like, it's been all day. So she just drinks a ton. Yeah, here he is, Clonic. Tell me, Lamb, do you believe Disney Immutable? We all the players in this game of chance. Trying to draw a tarot card? I don't... It's not letting me... Okay, let's try that again. Nope. Oh, it's glitching out, man. It's not letting me actually interact. Ah, that sucks. Well, I'll come back. Maybe it'll work again in a minute. Crap, I don't have any pervert. I know it might seem unnecessary to cut all of the grass, but it's just it's good for something, you know? I need it. Plus the mushrooms. Very helpful. Trade those for stuff. grab this. Also, the field of view it feels like it's much wider in this version. I don't know. I could probably change that in the settings on the Switch one, but I feel like it might overload it. Alright, let's try this one more time. It's gonna really suck if I can't... Ah, that sucks! It just glitched out. It won't let me actually interact. Man... Unless, wait a minute, it's because I messed up my controls. Could be the case. It is, that's why. I don't know why it would change that. It doesn't change any of the other stuff. Okay, now I gotta go back because, yeah, I had accidentally taken that off so I didn't have an interact button anymore. There we go. Okay, um... I like the rolling. So I didn't realize this was a thing. Oh, totally, poison. I know it probably makes more sense to get the critical hits, and I'm sure there's like some meta to it that I'm not recognizing, but like, I like to go for the stuff that's more obvious. Maybe that's why I'm a fool and a poor gamer, but you know what? Works for me. Um, hmm. Well, it's always good to get a new follower. Hello? 
peace be with you, Crusader. I seek only the truth and the light. But I may be of service to you. I can increase the loyalty of any follower you choose. Oh, oh, okay. Who's got low loyalty? We got some level ones. Uh, let's do it for Nanan Bray. My capybara boy. My work is done. This fool would follow you into the deepest darkness from whence no one returns. Hey, good. That's what I want. I don't want him to leave. I'm gonna cut your grass. What do you think about that, buddy? Yeah, that's what I thought. Ah, oh, great. He's a heretic. Well... I am surrounded by fools that don't see my genius, but you see it, don't you, Lamb? Admit your stupidity and my intellectual superiority, and I will be yours to command. Yes, I am a fool. Perhaps you are not as stupid as you look. Yeah, man, whatever. I don't really care. You can talk crap all you want. Don't really matter to me, even if you are correct. See, yeah, that part, the loading to, like, place the rooms, that takes forever on Switch. It's like a 30-second process at least versus the, like, nothing that it was just now. Yeah, give me that racks. Look at that, the poison like really knocks him out. Okay. Oh yeah, take the flies out immediately. Nice. Uh oh, uh oh. Ooh, this is a little tough. No, don't hit me. Don't touch me. Ooh. It's a little tricky sometimes. But we're good. We're safe! You know, for now. Ah, you got me from the back. Ah, crap, I keep using the triangle to try and hit the, uh, curse. Because I forgot what I assigned it to. that real quick. Um, make that triangle. Make heavy attack. That. Track three is also triangle. Didn't mess anything else up. I can't bleed on the battlefield. Let's see how it is. <sighs> Whoop. No, I didn't have any money. No! Or, well, fervor, I guess, but, you know, you know what I meant. Ah. Well, it was a decent run. Drake's wiggle. All right, let's do our usual. This part is also so much more efficient. Just runs real smooth. Thank you, double dancey. 
a double dancey. See, I set up the stuff so that they can do the seeds, but they're not going to because I didn't set up the, uh... I didn't actually set up the thing that lets them plant seeds, so that's kind of pointless. Yeah, none of them are doing any work. Because... Hey. Don't think I don't see that. Don't think I don't see that, buddy! Look at this pile. Look at this heap. Everybody's stacked up like crazy. See, yeah, I'm not a huge fan of like, uh, cutesifying cults. I hope that's not a controversial take. Like, it's satire, clearly they're not framing it as like, this is a good thing, but also it's like, they are definitely still treating it like, oh, tee hee, it's just a silly game, and it's like, eh. There are many people whose entire lives have been destroyed by cult behavior, so I don't know if I'm a fan of that. Um, I don't even have most of this stuff made. Oh my god, did I not even unlock the body pit? I didn't. That's embarrassing. Body pit. Over here. As far tucked in the corner as I can. Build it up real quick. Grab this body that's just been hanging out all friggin' day. Roasting in the sun. And then, oops, gotta fix that. Okay, and then we're gonna get some stuff going. Um, let's upgrade these sleeping quarters for these guys. Should probably get, yeah, stone mine going. Or I run out of stun. Oh, I have everything so tightly combined around here. I should really uh, spread things out a little more. Oh my god, do I not have enough beds for everybody? I don't. I have these. I'll have. Ten. Ah, Juna! Juna! Well, actually, I do have enough beds, I guess. Let me... Hold on. Let me... Get him. Ah, dip. Don't have a... What am I missing? Hold on. What am I missing? I don't got the cash or the wood. Well, dip. Alright. New guy. What's your deal? Faithless? Well, I guess that works out.
head for the mines. Then we will do a sermon. Then I may need to take a break to feed my cats. Yes. It's about that time. Maybe even a little late. Oops. It should be okay, though. I ended up feeding them a little late this morning. Shh, don't tell nobody. Possessions. Yeah, belief in materialism sounds good. Wish I'd done that before I did those two, but I didn't realize. Do you got any rituals? Um, I don't need to do that right now. want to do that yet. Uh, I'll save the rituals until after this one's worn off. Oh yeah, I can't get over it. It's literally so much smoother that it's actively a little too fast. Not the bullet death. Not the bullet death. Not to 50! Remember that? From the Princess Bride? It's a funny movie. If you haven't seen it, you should see it. Just watch that Once Upon a Deadpool, which is like the quote unquote PG 13 Deadpool 2. They like recreate the. the grandpa parts. From Princess Bride with an adult Fred Savage. Which is pretty neat. Oh, jeez. Y'all gotta use the bathroom, man. Uh oh. Yo! Do you not have a bed, my dude? But Nanabri lives here, though. Why does he have two beds? Greedy! Three D, two beds. So rude. I guess I'll plant some stuff since I don't have it set up for them to do that. Get some mushrooms going. Berries are good for food, but not great. Do these farm plots a lot tighter, but then I always run into the problem of um, if somebody's walking over them, I can't talk to them because they can't figure out whether I'm trying to plant stuff or water stuff or talk. So maybe I won't do that. I think we're doing okay. Yep, see, even in both versions, there's a little hitch. A little hitch when the day starts. Let's eh, eh. just fertilize everything. Get it good and set for some quality crops. That's the last of that. Oh, very close to leveling up. Not quite yet. Nice. Yeah, it's always great when you can get a few of them in one. 
I think the most I got was like five or six in a cluster. That felt great. Uh, you pay me. And you do dancey dance. Here too. I'll take it. Give me your money. Oh, leveled up. Getting close to another upgrade already. Yeah, it's very satisfying to like get all this stuff, but at the same time, it, it feels very like mobile app. Granted, they're not, like, charging you for it, so it's not too bad, but it's like, yeah, it's very addicting in a way that feels maybe a little... not so great. You... New guy. I think... Yes, that's enough for a body pit. I think the reason I don't have body pits is because I was just eating them. Hey, no. But, uh, we'll see how it goes. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nope, I meant build. Build. Can I build, please? Ah. Well, let's drop them in. go. A bit of wood. I uh, don't want the demon circle. Get on beds. I need to make one of these. Yeah, I need to do that. Because otherwise... Get any monies. We won't get any foods or monies. Oh, that guy was still holding a log. Wonder if it has anything to say. I guess we'll never know. that so that it's within in the area yeah we're gonna move you it's like right by where they walk after they get up I want to block the way Uh, here. This is where they sleep. Or where they eat. It's in between. Uh-oh, I am out of food. That's not good. What's, uh... No, not talking to you. Oh, what's up? Glorious leaders, elders of the cast for the cult and I'll seek a place to enjoy the final years. We should let them join us! They're good for some, uh, some stuff. What's that say? Minus five faith when a follower is sacrificed, ignores the centers when they preach. Cool. Sure, I'll take him. Well, dance a dance with me. 
Oh, and I'm already ready for that reward, eh? Just wanted the one. Yeah. Hey. Hey. You being dissenting? Back to work. Oh. Guys, we have bathrooms. There was like an an official animation they did that had Shady Vox as the uh the lamb. It's pretty funny. I didn't watch the whole thing, but should track that down and finish it sometime. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Crow, that's what I wanted. Ah, but it's on cooldown. Is that the one? Ooh, what one did I unlock? I don't like that at all. I gotta unlock that tarot one. That one's gonna be a lot more useful. And a brood. I could get the crypt. Uh, I'll unlock the next level here. Nice. Okay, guys. I am one shy of what I need for that farmer station. Okay, uh, I'm going to take a quick break and feed my cats, so I'll be right back. Okay, as promised, I'm right back. Um, all right, we gotta we gotta try and run a crusade before their faith starts falling again. Not a ton of time left, but we'll uh, we'll get some use out of it. Use out of it. Okay, my mic is still working. So always gotta check when I'm out here. Man, I've been getting pretty terrible pulls with the uh, weapons on this run. I don't care. 
I don't even know what it says. I don't read. Oh yeah, the, the, yeah, that ability's okay. I prefer the Vampiric. I prefer the one that poisons. I like the Necromantic, where it makes little ghosts. That's pretty cool. What's the, there's one that like gives you uh, fervor, and if you have the certain tarot card, it turns it into divine inspiration. So that's pretty cool. Or uh, whoops, I almost missed that skeleton. That would have been bad. I need all I can get. Ooh, ooh! Oh, baby! Just a cash flow right here. Ooh, that's nice. going. Um, finally got a chance today to watch, uh, my little brother was working for a few, for quite a while, I think a couple of years, on a short film that is called Dry Ur Sheets with a hyphen, and it's finally up on his website, uh, Gabriel, GabrielHinneman.com. So you can go watch his short film, Dry Ur Sheets. Uh, he also has a few screenplays on there. He's been doing a lot of screenwriting and uh, playwriting. And I haven't read his screenplays yet, but Dry Ur Sheets was pretty great. It's like a horror comedy. It's got some. It's got some decent. There's like at least one part towards the end that like really stuck with me. Like, oh, that's it's pretty dark. Um, take that one. Uh, I don't need another one. And like the comedy is really funny. There's a part with like a snack table at this play. <laughs> it's. I'm not gonna spoil it, but it's just. It's. It, it killed me. It was so funny. Uh, and it's pretty cool, because, like, you know, it's got, like, uh, it's all my family, you know? It's his twin, it's my grandma, my uh, aunt and uncle are in there. Uh, it's surreal for me watching it, because, like, it was all shot in my dad's basement. So... All the props and, like, the location are places I've been. But, yeah. I recommend y'all go watch it. Dude, it's pretty, pretty good. Uh, ooh, do I want another follower? Or do I want to shop? Shop could be good. Yeah, I think I'm good on followers right now. I only need to maintain seven. To, uh... Be able to get back in here. Beauty is truth, truth, beauty, and that is all you need to know of your heart. Don't care. Maybe. Ambrosia. Ooh. Ah, oh, do I want that? You know what? I'll just take that for free. Oh, I can still buy this one. Uh, no. Your generosity knows some bounds. I was trying not to hurt the guys, but sometimes we don't have a choice. Get rain the weight. Ah, oh, yeah, it's nice to just sit down and like play a game. That's the thing with, like, playing this on the Switch. It's like, I don't really spend a ton of time off-stream just sitting down and playing a game anymore. So, just, like, having a game that, you know, a couple times a week I can sit down for a couple hours and just... Chill out. Enjoy the world of the game for a minute. It's nice. I, I talked about this 
during my Hotline Miami playthrough, but like, um, there is like a certain zone, it's the, the flow state, right? I know from my studies that's what it's called, but like, that was the first time I consciously recognized that I had gotten into the flow state, and that I was, in that moment, able to like, drop right back into it. I don't know, I, it was a really cool moment for me as a gamer. I've never really gotten that before. I know my, like, my roommate can, like, go in and out of that at will. Well, go into that at will. I know about coming back out of it. I think it gets a little deep into the game. Gets, gets sucked in, never to be heard from again. But, yeah, I kind of wish I could just do that. It takes a particular sort of game. And there's, like, you know, there's a the whole immersion thing. I'd say... If you haven't watched it, I've, I shared it with several different people this week. Because it came up in different discussions. But, um... I'd recommend watching How About This Game... Uh, immersion. Which is a video by Barry Kramer. That was when he was an editor for Game Grumps, was on their channel Grump Out. So just one word, Grump Out. And it's, yeah, it's like a 12 minute video just talking about the immersive fallacy and, you know, what play is. Talks about the flow state and um, how games are representation. Yeah, vampiric acts, that's why I like. I also prefer the axes. They're a little slower, but like, they got a nice weight to them that feels real good. And I like being able to like one shot fools. Hmm. Well, revealing the map is kind of useless right now. Sometimes the tarot decisions are easier than others. But yeah, we're like right at the end of it, so I don't need to. I don't need that. Here we go, Eligos. Okay. Ooh, uh, well, that worked out. Just kind of wail on him for a minute. I don't have relics yet in this playthrough. That kind of sucks. Relics are super useful. I do have heavy, or no, I don't have heavy attacks yet. Man, I got nothing in this playthrough. Definitely remember being, like, much further along at this point in my other playthrough. No! Ah! Uh, I got greedy. Man, that was a short play, uh, short run. Hmm. Colder than I meant it to be. That's okay. As long as I'm hydrating, you know. Oh yeah, I gotta get that farming station set up. Doing this by hand is no good. Oh, I see you. I see you complaining. Think you can complain? No, sir. Not here. Not under my tutelage. Give me that cash. Oh, dance party? Dance party? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. You best believe I want to dance. Oh, I already asked you for cash. I know.
Man, I'm honestly... <laughs> the my my brother short film that I was just talking about I just keep thinking back to it like there's there's these layers to it where it's like on the surface it seems like just like kind of silly and there's like goofs the the costumes are like kind of half baked and the the performances are like really over the top but like man there's like yeah there's like a lot of stuff going on there I can't I don't know, I don't want to spoil stuff for you, but, like, the stuff they do is pretty interesting. Get in there. Heal up, you goof. build that armor station. Um, crank those out while I can. Whoops. Not what I meant to do. Nope. I'm trying to... That's it. That's the one. Okay, let's... Uh, nope, not the decorations. Although... Clear those notifications out. Farm station, that's what I need. Okay, I need to rearrange some stuff. Hold on. Let's, uh... Place him there for right now. Let's kind of scoot these around for a second. Okay, farmer station. Um, don't want those to overlap because that's just a waste of space. And I'll build this by myself. Oop. One thing I like is that if you just hit it, you just hit the button for the action, then it will toggle it to just go automatically, or you can hold it if you just want to do it that way. Having the two different options, real nice. Okay. Then uh, we're going to move things around a bit. And yeah, we can cluster them together. For the sake of efficiency. Good. It's all coming together. Okay, I think that that means now that they will do all this work that they otherwise were not. So 
so I will probably have to assign someone. Oh my god, is there no bed for the old guy? Guys, you gotta tell me when we have an old guy sleeping on the cold ground. Oh my god. Yeah, dude, go. Jeez. You make me feel like a jerk. Uh, do we got the... Okay. Fertilizer silo. Um, I will put the fertilizer silo. Oh, next to there. Oh, okay. That's daybreak. Um... He didn't even get back to bed. What you got for me? Leader would be so funny if I pulled some hilarious pranks on Thiarna. They are a real picky eater, so let's make them eat. Dookie. Uh, yeah, fine, whatever. It's gross. But if that's what you're up to, that's what you're up to, I guess. We dancing. Who we dancing? Who we dancing? Who we having a little dance party? And then a jewel. Uh, then, yeah. Give me that money, and then you can actually be. Oh, well, nothing for the farmer to do, I suppose. Thorn, thorn a tray. The noter, maybe. stuff going on. Um, probably some guys down in the mines. Well, I guess not. But whatever. Oh, everything's watered, I see. I'll make some breakfast. Oh, actually, we don't have many options. Well, let's just do a sermon. That's good enough. Yo, leveled up. Merciless. What does Merciless do again? Just critical hit. Uh, let's do some more curses. That's always good. All right. Oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Right there. Uh, we could do a new ritual. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, we got a ton of stuff that needs to go. Needs to grow.
Ba -ba boom Check the doctrine. Clear it out. Ooh, hey, and we got some cash. Thanks, guys. And then I believe it's the... Yeah, it's not until the next uh, farm station that they can do the harvesting for me. someone to be my farmer. Maybe Barbados will do it on his own. Yeah, there he goes. There he goes. Ooh, yeah, and we got some quality crops. Nice, nice. Be able to do another crusade, I think. After I... I'll put in some more farm plots so that they can build them while I'm away. Yeah, we got lots of room for farm plots. Sorry, I'm thinking that short film again. It's so funny. It's so bizarre. It's like a really great like horror comedy because it's just it really can s switch between like pretty disturbing stuff and like pretty funny stuff. Like really like at the drop of a hat. Um, and like it's not even even the like horror stuff is not like that much, but the way they frame it is like, man, it really gets you. At least it really gets me. I, I'm a pretty sensitive person, so I think I'm probably more sensitive to that kind of stuff, but I think it was pretty effective. I don't know. Okay, um, let's load in some more stuff to refine. So everybody's got a little work to do while I'm out. Uh, let's assign somebody officially as a farmer. Okay, and we're going. Ooh, somebody eat a grass meal. They're being picky about it. I don't know what to tell you. That's their problem. Not mine. Not mine at all. Somebody said in one of the voiceover chats I was in, someone was asking like, "What's a, what's a um?" All oh, right, I got actually grab weapon. Ooh, that's a new one. Uh, what's, like, a good way to learn a Scottish accent? I got an audition, how do I do it? And we were just like, oh, you know, use these references or that reference, you know? People were like, you could call, I was like, you know, you could call somebody who lives there, you can, uh, watch comedians or just, like, movie characters. Someone else said comedians, I said, like, actors in movies, and they were just like, um, yeah, comedians are even better because it's, like, performative, but it's still their natural voice. 
Uh, but someone pointed out, it's like, you know you have it right when you can't say pur purple burglar alarm in the accent. And I was like, never actually tried that. Hold on. Purple burglar alarm. Purple burglar alarm. Oh, it's tough. All the errors. Because I don't... It's a non rhotic accent. I don't really do the errors the way we do in uh, the States. Because the, the, the United States um, R... R is like a very kind of uncomfortable, difficult thing to do, hence why a lot of other accents don't have R's like that. You know, like, is it French? It's a F, it's a slip more of a soft Z than a R. It's not French, it's French, you know? it's Some people do a French with a W, but it's a little more of like a French, French. It's still an R. Which is a very soft R. But yeah, Scottish. I don't do it so good. So it's Paddle Bagalar Allah. Bagalar. Bagalar. Oh my god, it's it's very hard. Purple Bagalar Alarm. It's like the opposite of a tongue twister. It's designed to make you less exact. Got oh, okay. It's two for free. Nothing to slice. Ah, here he is. Here's the relic guy, Kemak. Ah, ah, the red crown and you, beast godly. Come, I have tools to give you. Yes, crafted by Kemak. My brothers, they might have pretty things, but mine, power, powerful things. Will you look? Will you take? What will you give in turn? Your flesh, your bone, your crown. Oh, oh, I jest, I joke. I won't take anything, nothing for the hammock. Relics, relics. Yes. Yes. I love relics. Oh, I haven't even used my curse. Powder box is just a random one. Then this is the intro set. I think some of these are unlocked with some of the DLC. I can't remember if this is the version that has that. All his teeth. Cool. And yeah, we just hit L1. Ah, ah, my pretty creations. Holy pieces of revered beings. They hunger, yes. Crave the power that was once theirs, yes. Even yes. They are hungry, hungry for miscreant flesh. Let them... Oh, worm. Oh, dip, I don't have it assigned to it. Oh, no, I haven't. Right, you gotta hurt him before you can use it. You get it based on how many uh, attacks you deal. There we go. Ah, yes, better than silly card, better than pointy sword. Kamak is better. Little god will come again. Kamak will give relic. Kamak will make relic. Kamak will make relic out of you one day. Bye bye. Sure, pal. Have you say so? Nope. Uh, nope. Let me. Thank you. Get a lot of extra bones when we hang out with Hamak. I'm not gonna go for much longer. I wanna. I've been sleeping terribly lately, so I'm gonna try and get you know, turn in early. Um. Yeah, probably around you know next half hour or so. So I think I will. Uh, ooh, I do like that guy. He's a cutie. Um. So I'll tell you all about the game I've been making. Uh, ooh, do we want wood? Yes. Yeah, we could use some wood. Um, so the game I've been making, I believe I've talked about it on uh, the stream last week. No, I didn't do a stream last week, so yeah. 
the game i'm making is called what if aliens uh what if aliens contacted us but they were actually really cool and just wanted to invite us to a radical pizza party it's uh, an intentionally ridiculously long name and if i ch in fact i've made it longer because it didn't have radical before so if I change it, it will be to make it longer or to reword it in a way so that there's an obvious, like, nickname for it. Or maybe to, you know, change up the, uh, acronym to something that's cutesy. I don't know. But, uh, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Um. Ooh. That's pretty good. I like that one a lot. Um. But it is a limited communication hide-and-seek game where the player who is hiding wants to be found. Basically, the idea is that aliens contacted these truckers. Well, these truckers ended up, you know, talking to these aliens, and the aliens are like, we're just doing a pizza party. It's sweet. Um, yeah, that's what we're going with. Um... But the FBI agents nearby were like, uh, no you're not. So, the agents are trying to stop you, and the goal is to get the aliens and the, uh, truckers in the same spot. Hmm. Uh, let's stick with what we got. Woo, not yet. Not yet, I got more stuff to explore. Is to get them into the same spot, there's like 12 locations on the board. And oof. there's like 12 locations on the board, and you want to get them to the same look. Dang it! Ah! I was distracted. You want to get them to the same location where there's no agents, right? But the twist, which is a recent twist, is that you have two separate maps, and you don't both know where all of the agents are because you set different agents to your maps, and they overlap. So you're trying to figure out, and you just play these cards. You play these cards, where you play three cards that have phrases on them, but you only get to pick one syllable out of each phrase. Um, and so you get three syllables, the rest is lost in the static. And you're trying to communicate where... Oh, I don't have enough flowers. You're trying to communicate where to meet up, through that system and then at the end of the turn after you've placed five of your guys on each side and you've played five messages each uh, you see if you won or not and after three rounds uh, that's it much simpler than it used to be it used to be way more complicated there was like also agents or there were uh, reporters and cops and there was like a whole rock paper scissors element because that's part of the jam prompt but eventually I was like that's just making it more complicated for no reason I'm taking that out and then it was too easy because it was just on a shared map. So like, even though I was having them place it face down, they could tell pretty easily what had been placed. So eventually, for the sake of the game, I figured out two separate maps, which in real life will be on separate, uh, behind separate like screens, you know? Got like DM screens that they, screens that they use in D&D. And, yeah, it's a cute idea. I haven't been able to playtest the newest version, but I think it will be pretty fun. The main thing is going to be figuring out, you know, what cards are obviously broken, balancing out, like, how many guys you place, how many agents you place. Uh, one of the things is that if there's two or three... So, the 12 spots, the 12 locations, are divided into four separate regions of three locations, right? And if there are agents at two or three, so, you know, more than one location in a region, then you get a new agent at every location. And if you get three or more agents, it gets locked down. So that the next day you can't even go there. And it makes it even harder to play stuff. Um, and you, like roll dice at the beginning of each round to see which six new agents you place. They can be overlapped. You know, for this or that. I think it's pretty neat. I think it's, it's going to be a fun game. I have been able to cut the rulebook down from ten pages to only 
seven just over seven and one of those is um ew i got meat out of the puke Ugh. don't eat that uh just over yeah just over seven and one of them is all just like flavor text like an intro page so it's it's pretty tight I think, uh, I think I might be able to tighten it up a little bit more, but who knows? I think that's all the core systems there, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, I want the farmer station too. Yes! Yes! Um, what else did I need? Uh, oh, yes. Yes. They just, uh, used up the... Not the stone mine. I need the wood. Oh, no. Or wait, is it the wood? Yeah, it's the wood. Uh-oh. That's not good. I think I need the, to give these guys more stuff to do. So they're consistently just hanging out, praying. I don't know. Uh, let's upgrade the farmer station. Ah, uh, they're good without food for a day. Let's do the sermon before it gets too late. I think I'll probably try and go on one more crusade before the end of the stream here. Yeah, then I gotta do all my skincare stuff, and I gotta brush my teeth and such. I'm trying to keep to a pretty, you know, not super strict bedtime routine, but I wanna try and give myself enough time to recognize that it's like, we're going to sleep now, so let's relax. And it's, it's been working out. Um. Hmm. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, let's do the glory through toil. Ooh, and I can actually do it. Do I dare? I do indeed. Let's do it. Yes, work, my children, work! Okay. Give me that cash. Uh, ooh, he leveled up. And we're gonna cru- nope. I'm gonna crusade, but I accidentally hit the zip button at the worst time. Actually, you know what? Ah, Yartre! Where he at? And we're gonna harvest that meat. Uh, uh oh. Ugh. Yeah. Um, one of these, and a couple of those, one of those, and some of that. Hopefully Therna 
eats that dookie for that uh, quest. Gotta keep them fed. They're gonna be working a lot. Yes, yeah, sorry, Gushion. Ah. All right. Thank you. Sweet. That's commandment stone. going. Alright, one last time. Uh, let's actually buy this capybara. Come back now. Uh, well, it doesn't matter if the thing collapsed because they're not going to sleep for a few days anyways. Chopping down this stuff. I think I can beat the boss this time. That'd be an awesome way to end the stream. Believe I've been this boss on my other playthrough, although my other playthrough is also way further along because I've been I have way more stuff to do at my uh at my cult. So let's see how it goes. Nice. Uh, yeah, I don't know why this is the fleece I got. The tarot card one is... I was still, like, pretty early into the game, so I didn't get it. And I wasn't really paying attention to a lot of the mechanics. I feel like I just understand the game a lot better this time around. So I feel like I make better decisions. Oh, I think I prefer that one. Any that gives health. Because I have a pretty gung-ho, just like bash and crash kind of technique. So, uh... Wait. That's the wrong way. There we go. Oops. Right, that is not a ranged one. Okay. Get that probe. That thing probe. good run. There we go. There we go. Oh, it'd be nice if I could get a relic, maybe. I could use a relic, maybe. Nice up. Always want to try and use the curses on at least two guys to make it worthwhile. Really maximize the expenditure of that resource. Plus, I don't know the numbers yet, but I feel like if you get at least two guys with it, you can recharge at least one. There we go. Bow, bow, bow. Can we get berries? Yeah, let's go for the slightly easier path here, just because... It'll be easier for me. Ooh, pumpkin. Let's get some pumpkin seeds. Uh, oop. 
Ah, I was gonna try and maybe break some stuff, but we're okay. Man, I gotta say, yeah, one of my favorite... The PS5 obviously runs games better. Um, and I do really like the controller. It feels very nice in the hand. The slight grippiness. Like, the texture. I love a textured controller. That's what I like most about the uh, one I use in my studio. But, uh, yeah, my favorite bit is just the mic button. Just the fact that it has a built-in microphone that you can use if you really want to. And it has a button for you to just immediately, like, mute the mic. And then unmute it. So that, especially streaming, it's like, I have an external mic, but it still works with that. It's just whatever your input is. It freezes enemies could be good. Let's take, let's take this. I like these. I like the gauntlets. I think I'm curious too, because one of the things that they play with in that short film, um, oh, I see, I gotta take that guy out. Oh, I haven't run into those guys in my other playthrough. That's a cool mechanic. Uh, one of the things they really play with is the fact that my brothers are twins. And so, the two characters with speaking lines... Mm. Uh, I'm gonna take this. Oh. It's not what I meant to do. But whatever. The two characters with speaking lines are twins. And they're, like, playing separate characters in costumes. But then it's also, like, in the earlier parts, um, the one who made the short film is playing two different characters, but then later they're doing a play about what happened at the beginning. But then they're playing separate characters, and it's... Yeah, it's, it's like, a lot of weird layers that are super cool. Really, really like it. I, it's also, it's not like I'm surprised, because, like, my brothers are, like, the funny... Dang it! Ah, I got so distracted. Once again, I keep getting distracted during the boss and just going bonkers. Well, I'll clean up stuff and then finish the stream off. But, um, yeah, they're, like, the funniest people I know. When they get together, they're, like, they're so funny. But, like, man, it's just... It's, it's real good. It's real good. Alright. Go... G give me your money, and then go... Sleep. Oh, cool. Leveled up. But yeah, I'm real curious what uh, what it's like for people who didn't grow up with my brothers and can't tell them apart watching that, where it's like, at a certain point, a second, a second character comes in who's played by an actor who looks very similar to the other main actor who's played all of the characters so far. 
very, very interesting choice, for sure. Alright, let's clean some stuff up. Fix the collapsed beds. Though, not that it really matters too much. Oh man, and now I gotta do all that crap again? Ugh, there's a point my roommate was like, you just don't have to talk to him every day. And I'm like, I know, but I'm still at the point where it is kind of worth it. Once they hit, like, level 6, it's not... It's like, 5 or 6, right? I don't usually get them above 5, but if you get them to that point, it's not really worth it anymore. But up to that point, you can get some decent stuff out of it. Son of a... You're sick too. Okay. Go. Go get some rest. Man, three guys sick. Three guys sick right now. Absolutely ludicrous. Uh, ooh, maybe I should do compost. Yeah, that's a good idea. Um... Oh man, this whole place is a mess! Why are you guys puking everywhere? Oh my god! Ah, nasty, nasty kids! Wait. I actually need all the wood I can get because I can't get a new logging whatever unless I uh, get that set up. Oh good, Gushin. Gushion is no longer ill, so let's... Hey. Talk to me. Pay me. Yeah, I really wish that stuff could be automated, because it's a bit tedious. Cool. All good. I should change that to something that isn't the... Yeah, see what I mean? Just trying to talk to the farmer here. But it's giving me guff. Okay, let's do one last sermon. And then we're done for the night. Oh, and the crown. Well, actually, maybe I should go swing... Yeah, I'll go swing by all the other spots since I did it at the beginning of the stream. To the crown. Let's do an afterlife one. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Whoops. 
forgot to clear out the notifications, but that's okay. Do we have enough? No, we don't have any. We ain't got nothing. Alright, clean that up. And let's swing out to the other spots. Yeah, I think I cleaned this cult up pretty nice, having been away for as long as I was. So we'll see, we'll see uh, how this goes. Um, this was, I was gonna do Shovel Knight, but I really just wanted to play more Cult of the Lamb. Frankly, I've been really into it lately. So that's been my resolution more or less, not like a New Year's resolution or anything, but just like coming back to the stream, it's like I wanna just play games that I'm actually enjoying. And if I feel like there's another game I'd enjoy more, or for whatever reason, I'm just not feeling the games I'm playing um, on stream that I should just play, you know, something else. Still don't know where you get the crystals. Because overall, how much I'm enjoying the experience directly reflects how enjoyable the stream will be. I am H.O., so... Uh, let's just buy them all. 100 for the whole set. And then that guy, I really gotta get a lobster so this guy will give me the thing I need to get the tarot. Uh, fleece. Alright, let's do some fishing. Yeah, exactly. Like, that was the thing, is that when I switched to fighting games for a while, I thought... I started doing great. Whoa, new relic. Hey. Because I was having an awesome time, but then when I got really deep into the grind, it's like my numbers stagnated and I was kind of grumpy about it and it just, it just didn't work out. I still want to get back to it at some point, but you know, I, I think, like I said, it'll probably be like a once a month thing of just like checking in like where am I how am I doing you know let's run some let's run some matches see where I'm at in the tower but uh yeah as it has been lately I've had so little time for games that uh practicing games is like I just don't got the time I haven't even really practiced piano this week I was really getting back into piano for a minute, too, and then I, uh... Yeah, this last couple weeks, because I was so busy with the jam, I was just like, ugh, I should just get more work done on the jam, rather than doing this, but, uh... Gonna get back to that, gonna get back to writing the anime, you know? Gonna gonna keep working on the game, but it'll be more like a... Just getting a couple playtests in a week and keep at it. Because the average is like 70 to 100 playtests for a finished game. So I've done five. I think the rule of thumb I'm seeing, and I don't know if this works for every playtest, but in my experience this has been the case in the couple of jams I've done. The first like 10 playtests are what it takes to get the game like really going. Those first 10 are just like... Uh, are really just figuring out the core game. So, you know, I think by this point, I do have, like, a real game, and I can finally go into, like, balancing stuff and, like, maybe small changes. You know, getting rid, like, dealing with any, like, really broken uh, strategies. But... Nope, should have gone further out. There it is. 
but it definitely feels like I finally found what the game needs to be to work for the concept I'm doing. Freaking lobster! Ugh, why is it taking me so long? It took me a while to get him in the other one, but I did get him, I think, before I even unlocked the, uh... The mushroom guy, so I don't know why I'm having so much trouble finding a lobster in this one. I just need one, man. Just need one so that I can finish out the, uh... The gem and get that other fleece. Please! Ah, it's the lobster I'm looking for, right? Yeah. Well, whatever. We'll just do the mushroom guys, and then I will call it a night. Thank you all for watching. I know I'm not, I have been generally kind of sporadic with streams, and um, this one's kind of short, and it's kind of weird because it's a different day than I've been doing them. But uh, yeah. I had a good time. Yeah, thank you for watching. I I also like having the option to play in my living room on my couch. It's it's always nice. That's why there's no camera this time. I'm streaming straight from the PS5. Um Yeah, the couch is just more comfortable than in my uh in my studio where I'm at an office chair, the same one I work at, so there's like a element of stress to that because it feels like work. You did it, didn't you? You tasted the power of the mushrooms. Yes, you are just like Sozo. Sozo knows you are a friend. Here, you must take this. A sign of friendship between two lovers of the mentosine mushroom. Keep it safe. You can trust no one. No one. Is that it? Is that the final one? Nope, that's only the second one. I wish to give you something else, something to symbolize your undying adoration of the mentified mushrooms and their limitless potential. Ooh, that's cool. I like that. No need to thank Sozo. Build it at your cult, then come back to me. Sozo shall grant you one last gift. Sozo is always fair, always repays his debts, not like those liars out there. Um, I will just zip back to my cult and save. And then we will find someone to stream over to. Be sure to take a minute to check out the Discord. Always, always like to see more people in Discord. And, uh, yeah, follow, subscribe, all that stuff. Really appreciate it. All right. Let's see who there is to raid over to. We got... Mm. Spielermon. Sure, we'll go with Spielermon playing Mario 64. Game I'm not a huge fan of. I like it enough, but when you're when I was streaming it, obviously I had a kind of a tough time because I'm just pretty bad at it. Um Oh, there it is. Had to close the keyboard on the iPad for it to show up. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Let Spielermon know I sent you. Have a great rest of your evening. Talk to you later. Goodbye. A goodbye. A goodbye.